Right then, guys, here we go. A uh, very special car, really. A Challenger. Not an E-Type, although it looks very similar. Some guys, I've just come in the yard here because I cannot get on. I can't do um, <laughs> a video with this car without a crowd of people around it. Uh, and uh, loads and loads of people just now taking pictures of it, stood next to it, all the rest of it, all convinced it's a Jaguar, which, of course, it generally mostly is, but it's in actual fact a Challenger. So, uh, so don't run away with the idea it came out of the Jaguar box because it didn't. Uh, so, um, so here we go. Um, but it does make a lot of sense. 4.2 Jag running gear, and all seems to be Jaguar. Uh, so you've 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 nearly got yourself an E-Type, haven't you? Um, sorry. So uh, yeah, you've you've all but got yourself an E-Type, but perhaps without quite such an eye-watering price ticket. Uh, showing 56,000 miles on there look don't know whether that's right or wrong I haven't got too involved with the paperwork side of things uh, but uh, interior is, is okay it's serviceable hoods fine now the hood I'm pretty sure you'll get that third clip on there but but it is tight and I don't want to be the one to break anything so I'm leaving it just like that just for the time being bodywork is generally very good there's a couple of paint imperfections uh, we've got a little bit across the back panel there, which you won't really see on here, but there is an imperfection there, and there's a bit on the front edge of the bonnet. Uh, other than that, I think it's all very, very good. Uh, comes with a hard top. I've just sat on that trailer there just for a minute or two. Again, doesn't fit particularly well. It was, it was held on with one clip and a bit of tape. Uh, but anyway, it's a nice addition should you want to use it uh, in a bit of uh, bad weather or whatever it might be uh, A few spares again odds and sods There's a bag of bits and pieces in there look some dashboard stuff uh, Boot rack and some other odds and sods. I've just thrown out for a minute or two and In there. There's the bit of course 4.2 Jaguar triple carbs big alley rad brilliant look at that ideal so even a bit of room for storage look so um yeah make a lot of sense doesn't it fiberglass bonnet but a good fiberglass bonnet you wouldn't know now painting perfection got a bit here just on this corner again you can maybe just make it out and there's a bit here round here if you can see my finger just round this corner here off color so there you go you can see it there look so she is off color there which is a shame right on the front another bit there look there's actually three bits along this side but what a shame a little bit there whether you'd bother to do them don't know it's up to you in it uh no then i was trying to find the 4.2 bit anyway but it is 4.2 uh i'm told so uh, so we'll stick with that so there you go i think you should uh, come up and have a little look really it's one of them cars that um, it's going to uh, float your boat or you're going to walk away and just dismiss it, aren't you? One or the other. Nip up and have a little look. Thank you.